Yeah! I think some spit just flew out of my mouth. That was probably gross. What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Just getting out of the house from uploading. Woo, it's bright out here. I don't know about y'all, but it feels like spring. South wind, high sun. Not, not only mostly sunny, but completely sunny for the next week, it looks like. Long story short, what I'm getting at, spring snow goose conservation uh, has obviously been upon us for what? Uh, going on two weeks, one week, pretty much. Uh, it started out great. We had a lot of sun. Not so, Actually, not so much sun, sun. We had a lot of snow. A lot of snow. Where am I going? A lot of snow uh, and ice and cold temperatures. What I'm getting at is uh, it made the uh, birds extra vulnerable. And with our sand pits in my area, we loaded up. We were, I mean, beyond loaded up. I'm pretty sure the uh, description loaded up was an understatement for how many birds that were here only two days ago. Only two days ago, here in my hometown, not only did I witness an entire morning, it was actually the video that you guys watched last, the uh, Facebook uh, Marketplace video, the decoys. The morning of that hunt, I watched and I, and I, I never sound, I never want to, sound crazy with my bird count uh numbers but there was half a million geese that migrated into my area stayed for two days and now they're gone before i go any farther i want to let you guys know the snow goose hoodies and them thermal vests from ducks and hats white hats everything it is available and i appreciate you guys picking it up I always link it down in the description below, as well as the podcast is linked down, down in the description below. I'm giving away a two-man turkey hunt in literally a few days, handful of days. Uh, so that's for this spring, two guys, two lucky guys, full paid ex uh, trip, except for travel. You got to travel down here, but everything else, uh, uh, commodity, uh, accommodations, beds, sleep, lodge, everything, hunt will be provided. All you got to do is subscribe to the podcast to get entered in that giveaway. Okay, back to uh, what we're getting at. Joe and I, we scouted literally all morning. Found one itty bitty feed of snow geese. And we're like, suddenly we're like, what? They all left. <laughs> all 500,000 of them suckers gone. I don't think they all left. They actually pushed east uh, quite a ways. And uh, we're just getting a lot of new birds migrating. It's, like I said, it's going to be south wind for the next few days. We watched migrators just roll over one particular area. We found the migration line, long story short. And we are headed to go set my first Kansas permanent spread right under that migration line. And I'm going to hunt it the next several days. Hopefully it's good the next few days. Hopefully it's good just today and tomorrow. But hopefully the next few days we can squeeze some birds out of it. Don't know what's going to happen. Completely winging it here, y'all. I've always wanted a permanent spread, and today I'm going to get it. But we're going to get loaded up here. I don't know what all we're going to take. The farmer don't want me driving in the wheat. He said I could drive in the wheat stubble, which will basically get us out there. But we're going to have to truck in a lot of decoys. We better get going. Well, 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 we didn't need the side by side, thank goodness. We're able to pull on in here. There's four snows already. We're sitting right at, I think it's 12.30. Is it right at noon 30, boys? Noon 30, one o'clock? 1.40. 140? Oh, we're way late. Uh, we got specks and Canada's, four snows that just went over. So what this field is, y'all, every single year during the spring migration, this field is hot. And as you can hear them in the background, there's birds everywhere already. The birds have already been using this field. Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a big mud spot where they've been using it for the past, I don't know how long. The boys are already carrying out the white socks. I have no idea how many we're gonna set. Look at these three above you, dude. Look. <gasps> you can shoot them. It's the white bags. Oh my, look at these three snows. They're already wanting in there. All right, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Oh, this is, could be epic. I will get the camera when we're done. Oh, look who's here, old P. Diddy Slim. Oh, it's been a long break. It's been a long break, you've been gone. 
good to be back though. Are you? Are you glad? Yes. I can't Yay! Wait to We're all glad. Here is the spread, my greater central. This is uh, what, all we're gonna do. I'm sorry for the wind. Uh, it's probably going pretty badly. We got up one, two, three, four, four flyers on the left side. Me and old Frederick. Oh, that, that doesn't mean get up. Sit, lay down, lay down. Good boy, good. This is where we're laying. Four, man, that's all. We got three flags, four flyers, and how many socks, Joe? How many do you think? Oh, 1,200. 1,200? How many bags do we have? Roughly 10. Oh, there's lessers that already landed in the uh, spread or in the field. Here's these two snows, though. Uh oh. It's weird. Look, I'm in a t shirt. Uh, these birds have been nothing but dark, been flying back and forth all day since we started sitting up all day i mean in the for the last, it only took us an hour to get up what i'm gonna say is probably 120 dozen ish somewhere right there 120 dozen is what we have up permanent spread here comes the e-collar let's go are you ready old freddy rico look he hears that e-collar he's going dad what is going on what is it fred what is it man load her up p diddy Load her up. <laughs> oh, jeez, look at these specs. <laughs> there are birds everywhere. And none of them are snow geese. <laughs> Said so there's birds everywhere and none of them are snow geese. <laughs> the specs are just eating it up, landing next to the spread as we speak. We've seen two groups of migrators. A lot of mallards. Uh, one group kind of looked at us a little bit, and that was about it. Hopefully, it is right at 3:45. Hopefully, 4 4:30, we start seeing some more birds. around there's some there's a pack of two and a pack of three snows all in all these darks come on snow oh boys uh oh boys here they come good group Fred lay down cover Fred up cover it buddy lay down really good little group there's Yep, uh, what is there, one, two, seven? Come on. In the meantime, I'm having me a cracker. Mm. I've been sitting here just munching away. It's so nice out here. Beautiful weather. <laughs> Oh, what is it, Fred Red? Yeah, you know the deal. Oh, that's some good stuff right there. Good job, Frederick. He's a good boy. These ducks. Oh my goodness, look at this. Intel. Pintail. Oh yeah. Oh, maybe not. Man, we just had a group of honkers literally go right over our heads. And here's a group of snows that looks like they're not really liking us again. <laughs> what do you think, Fred? Huh? What do you think? Oh yeah. Oh, they're doing it, boys. They're doing it. Yeah, buddy. Lay down, Fred. Right up top. We got it down one, so we don't get skunked here. Oh, yeah, get ready, boys. Hey, take him high if we need to, boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. 
No noise might be better than a lot of noise. Oh, he likes it. He like, don't turn it up too loud. He likes it, boys. Oh, here he comes. Get ready on the right. <laughs> Set. You gotta kill him. He's gonna stay on your right. He ain't gonna come over. He's gonna stay on the right side. Man, I don't know if he likes it. He turned around. That's the best working bird we've had all day. Oh, they're low, boys. Get ready. Lay down. Lay down. You see him go to right here. Lay down, lay down, lay down, lay down, lay down. Here we go, boys. Get ready. We're gonna we're, we will shoot. On three, two, one. Shoot him! Oh my gosh, why didn't we hit anything? Didn't drop one. We're, we're just gonna cut this clip right here. I think you should leave that. Oh my gosh, Fred, come on. Lay down. How in the, how, why didn't we kill one? I didn't have a shot with my gun. You Don't, shut I on one bird. Why didn't we shoot one? I stayed they on decoyed one beautifully. Lay down. No, we'll fly. Oh. Well, boys, we shouldn't be skunked right now, but I was trying to be safe and took the shell out of the receiver of my gun while I was on the phone. And these three yahoos, I don't know what happened. <laughs> I mean, there's no excuse. I, I have no <laughs> idea. Well, we, we can at least go back and see the shot cam of you, but I don't know about the <laughs> Just yank but it away. Up, but so I don't want to watch it. <laughs> Just rerun the shot cam. Let's see what I did wrong. Let's see where the wads were. I'll slow it down a little more, maybe. Give it a nice jog. Give it a nice jog. There you go. We might have birds are coming. That little wing flap made you go airborne for a little bit longer than a normal jump. It did. I mean, my vertical is just. One thing I do know, dude, the low light right now is pretty beautiful with the pink, with pink sunsets. Beautiful. Do what? The color of the sky is like all the way around. Let me see your hat you got there. Oh, I heard one. I heard one right above us. Uh, I really want to have some Sandhill Flyway hats. Y'all have been asking for them a bunch. Shoot them! Yeah, uh, we're not skunked. <laughs> Did you get the GoPro off? <laughs> I think I got everything on, at least the shot cam. Yep. <laughs> Came out of nowhere and just did him dirty. Woo! Alrighty. That's what's up. Here, Fred, here. There we go. Let's see our one beauty of the day. It's the witching hour, like I said. I'm right here. The one beauty? Oh, the one beauty. I'm sorry. It's all you, babe. What do you got? Big old adult. We took a headshot right on the kisser. No band on him, eh? Mm -mm. You're hiding it in your hand? He's hiding it. Definitely no band. Definitely. Definitely old bird, though. It is. Anyways, here's the spread. Haven't really showed you guys. There she is. This is, <laughs> this is where we're sitting here. And uh, just big. Really no shape in particular. Uh, got a kill hole in front of us that is just kind of sporadic. Nothing too major, nothing too dynamic. Just kind of threw them out. What's this coming from the south? Little group. Little group. Let's try them. It could be it. Get out. Witching hour. 
Right here, Fred. Lay down. Oh, I'm feeling good. We're taking a three and a half inch BB, just like the last one, and loading her first. Mm-hmm. It's nice. bad. Uh, so snow goose season, you can shoot 30 minutes uh, before sunrise and 30 minutes after sunset. P Diddy, what time is sunset? Uh, six seventeen. What time is it now? It is 6.17. So we got 30 minutes. Yep. Which is so weird. Hey, what are these coming though? For real though. We may have some birds coming, okay? Oh boy. That is white. They're all white. No, they're not done, boys. Take what you can. We got the two coming. Here we go, Fred. Set. Lay down. Lay down. Watch these specs. Okay. Yep. Yep. Holy cow. Nothing fell. I love it. My gun just completely took a poo. I am way too fat to be twisting that far. Wow. <laughs> well, I got a gun malfunction. Finally just found it. My uh, ejection handle flew out and so did gauges on the same go. No idea why, but it's getting dark. We still have 20 minutes left and check it out. I mean, it's getting dark. This time of year is so awesome, man. We're in t-shirts sitting up the spread. We're gonna leave it up overnight. Pray and cross our fingers that no one messes with it tonight. I would hate if someone actually did that. I don't think that there's anyone around here that would do that. Uh, it's not far off the road, which kind of scares me, but uh, gonna keep our keep our uh, fingers crossed and hope that everybody has respect. You know, that's the thing about permanent spreads is uh, you can't really trust everyone, and even though you want to, man, 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 this is beautiful. Well, we're gonna leave the spread. We loaded up everything. Um, look at this sunset. Absolutely gorgeous. So pretty. Oh, hi there, Freddy boy. He's loving it. It's gorgeous out. What are you watching on your phone? Snapchat. Snapchat. There's a couple people on there. Just a couple. Nah. Back home, and we're cooking. Tomorrow, <clears throat> tomorrow we're going into the spread, walking in it. <clears throat> Probably seven o'clock. Sorry, I've been eating chips. Uh, we're cooking. Old P Diddy doing his thing that he does. Look at him. Don't act like you do the dishes now. I never do the dishes. Exactly. I, that's a man. I Dude, already cooked for on. 15 people. I yeah. don't want to do the dishes. So he was like, what do you want to do for dinner tonight in the field? I was like, yeah, hey, good idea. I was like, what about a small boil? Can be good. Yeah. Fun little one. Small boil, sausage, mushrooms, corn, taters, bush light. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do you got going over here? What all is in this? Explain uh, to the people at home. An onion, a lemon, some orange. What else I got? Uh, garlic. Just a little bit of. This is the sauce. Everything. Yeah, the sauce, the juice. The sauce, the juice, and over here. Pretty much the same thing, right? Yeah. We're just having two, to do two. Two batches. Yeah. And then, oh, and then you got the good stuff over there. What do you got over here? Yeah, Bob said there's only three of us, so get get more of the good stuff. Ooh, 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 ooh. crab legs. Crab legs. A and lobster tail each. Ooh, and lobster tail each. Feasting. I'm ready. I'm hungry. Let's cook. There, everybody gets their fair share. Yeah, three of us. He's making a platter for each one of us. My goodness, what all you got left? Got the best stuff. Oh, the mushrooms, the corn. Oh my goodness, dude! 
He's just doing work out here, old P. Diddy. We got it going on. People are missing out at home. <laughs> the people that aren't here yeah. watching the video or the guys that are normally here? Well, the, you know, the people at home, they need to be stay in tune and follow Sandhill Flyways on Instagram so they can stay mm -hmm. you know, up to date when we're going to open these books up. Because this right here, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to eat. Me too. Yeah, we'll probably go to McDonald's and the gas station. Oh, I just ate a biscuit out of the refrigerator. Well, darn the luck, you're going to have to get more food. We, shooting lights in 10 minutes. Is it really? I think so. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, it's going to be a great day. We don't have to sit a decoy one. May not shoot a bird one. That's very possible. After yesterday, having a big whiff on a five pack and then only down in a single. That's not what I want. Uh, it's not looking likely like it's going to be a crazy day. But it'll be crazy fun because we don't have to to work. The spread's already there. Hopefully someone didn't steal it. I mean, that's the possibility that scared me about doing it, just leaving it up overnight. I uh, asked Wade, I was like, hey, do you have any of those cell phone trail cams? And I guess you have to like put service to him. He already cut the service off to him. All right, let's roll. Let's make the hope that the spread's still alive. Fred, what is it, man? Ooh, we got a few more white birds on the left. The spread is here. It didn't get stolen. Yay! Check her out in the sunlight. Looking gravy. Joe's getting the speakers a going. Oh, yeah. We already had one, uh, one flock pretty low come over the top. Uh, seeing good movement of birds this morning. We are late. Look at that flock. Uh, that's a good flag. Yeah, flag him in. Oh, flag him in, Gage. Flag him in. How pretty does that look with that Kansas sunrise? Oh, yeah. That's a good flock. All right. Let's see if we can uh, shoot better than yesterday. How about that? Oh, what'd you bring us, P. Diddy? Special delivery for Joe. He wanted 20 chicken biscuits. Chicken biscuits from the Mickey D's. Well, I actually wanted two because they're two for three. Two for three, yeah. That's one heck of a deal. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that smell of Frederick. You want a piece of that? Oh, yeah. Hopefully, I got that on shot cam. I know that I didn't hit a darn thing. Good boy, lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Preston just cranked a long one. I think he was hit and it just it, it scared him know, and he died. Right when you shot, he dude, he stoned. He crunched. Well, we got one in the bank. We have already tied yesterday. Frederick, do you want the last of a chicken biscuit? Here you go. That's a good boy. Oh yeah. Oh, we got another single juvenile snow goose up top, boys. Come on. Currently using one of the flyers as a flag. How real does that look? Oh yeah. <laughs> I think Fred's sold. Oh, they're looking really nice. Hope I don't jinx it. Oh, come on, baby. We got a four pack working really nice here. Here we go. Here we go, Fred. Are you ready? P. Diddy's the sharpshooter of the day. We're gonna need you. Oh, up front, up front. Yeah. Oh, one down. <laughs> Same deal. Fred, here. Well, now we have beat yesterday. Lay down, lay down. Oh, Trips got it. it lay down. Doubled up from yesterday. <laughs> Doubled up from yesterday. Two on the board. Call it a win. Let's go home.
Yeah, they were they were behaving like juvies. What do you got? Oh, uh, nice looking Rossi adult. That is not a juvenile bird whatsoever. Heck yeah. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Well, first migrator spread of the year. Uh, we have killed three birds in, I don't know, 10 hours. <laughs> May not be the right fly line. Let's see a fly line off to the east. I'm sure this fly line moves anywhere from two to four miles, if not more, east to west as it's going north. But uh might leave the spread here and uh, go do some scouting about, I don't know, a handful of miles away. I think there's a lot of snow geese over there. Just pretty, pretty slim. Pretty slow. It's beautiful. I've been working on the spread, making it bigger, but I don't think it's going to matter because we ain't seeing no boids. Well, me and Preston have been scouting Fred Hill. And, uh, Hill. We just went by a uh, snow goose feed south of us, Hill. And I looked out and there's a dead snow goose out in this field. We're going to see if Fred. Hill. Sit. Sit. Fred. Hopefully he sees him. That's a long one. Oh, he's on him. That is, that's like a 200. How many yards is that, you think? A couple 200. 200 yarder. Bam. He can see them white birds from so far. Good. Here. Let's go. Probably nasty. I had to force him to pick it up. I'm like, fetch it up. Fetch it up. It's probably nasty. I bet an eagle got to it. There he comes. Every bit of a two. Yep. Yeah. Every bit of a 200 yarder. God, heel. Oh, it's not tore up. Here, let me see it. Okay, drop, drop. Good boy. We, oh yeah, he got, oh, he's nasty. Yeah, he definitely got ate by an eagle or something. Yeah. Think he's lying? I don't think so. What you got on there? Oh, can't rewatch can't, him. Can't rewatch him. Joe just put something on the old Snapchat looks like him and Gage they stayed at the spread while Preston and I went scouting a little bit we found something really good for tomorrow so um, snapchat says that they killed five or six more by themselves Joe's a joker I don't know it looked legit so we'll see when we get back you think he's lying I think he's truth really yeah We probably could have shot two or three more. We were kind of being a little greedy on, but really, yeah. Decoy and whale, yeah, not too bad. They're all, uh, all pretty gray. All juvies, huh? Yeah. Small groups. Yep, small groups. But I'll take it. We've been gone for what an hour? Oh yeah. yeah. Probably an hour. Had to go get me a new swig. A new swig? We're at eight birds. Yeah. Gage, how many did he just he mob just, on? He just shot two. Two out of the last group by himself. You were, you were doing the duty over in the tree row, right? Yep, I was visiting the fence post. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, we're going to keep it going here. I got us a feed. Nice. <laughs> Best vlog of the day. Oh, we got one. Oh, we got two. <laughs> How many did you shoot? Uh, we shot six while you were gone. You shot two by yourself? Yep. Everybody was gone but you. Everyone. Oh. I wasn't gone. I was just Look at that. You boys have been stacking them up. All gray but one. All gray but two. All right. Let's see if we can keep going. Oh, yeah, dude. They are getting down fast. Here we go. Wow. These were migrators right here. They came from really high. I'm trying to block the glare on the camera, y'all. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Go down! Oh, you got him! Yeah! Oh. 
He's right here. Fred! Good, here. Oh, Fred got the Rossi here. Good boy. That's an old Rossi. Look at him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dude, they came down from the heavens. I mean, from a long ways and took no time to do it. Oh, look, they got they got a yellow face on them. The old rust face. Old rusty face. That was amazing. Good job, Fred. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Good boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Pintails. I want to know what you got. Oh, all the honk daddies are coming out to play. We're picking up. It's done. We've been here right at 24 hours. We hunted evening, morning. Uh, what time is it right now? What time is it? Right at noon. Yeah, right at noon. 24 hours set. We're done. We've seen enough. Uh, lots of migration today. Lots of dark birds. Not a whole lot of white. I got a little, I got, I got a little, I got, I found a good feed for the morning. And I think we're going to run nothing but full bodies on the end of a tree row. But, Fred, sorry, bud. I think we got nine down. That's not bad, dude. That's not bad at all. About 10 birds for the last 24 hours. Hey, I'll take it. It could be worse. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. All picked up out here in the old t-shirt. It's a lovely day. It's gonna hit 70 degrees today. I think we're currently at like 66. 66 right now? Yeah, it's a little warm. Oh, it feels great. We're gonna get ready to uh, go get some lunch, chill, and get ready for uh, tomorrow morning's hunt. We got a good, uh, good, good feed. Not real big, uh, probably a thousand birds in it, you know. Uh, this fly line that we sit, the old MIG rig, <laughs> as Joe said, the old MIG rig, migration rig. Uh, it was the only fly line that I honestly found yesterday. And so we just sent it. Uh, I'll show you the pile pick here in one second. But check out the snow goose trailer. All the full bodies in front. So tomorrow's hunt, full bodies only, is what we'll be using. Tree row, A frame. We'll try her. E collar on low, you know the deal. Uh, here's the pile. 24 hours. <laughs> Nine birds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven juvies, and two adult Rossies. This one here is really cool. He's got a yellow face, rusty. I might mount him. Uh, I asked y'all what would be the coolest mounts for the lodge. Y'all agreed with my first idea and opinion and that would be hanging them from the ceiling that's kind of what i was getting at. all over in that corner you got to have like a tornado going the other, yeah the other thing i think it'd be real cool next year when we start getting into some mallards yeah off the uh wood post for the stairwell yes mm -hmm. have them coming out of it flying yeah. you know yep i think it'd be beauty yes sir any more ideas um next time we set a make rig let's make sure the mig portion is actually happening <laughs> <laughs> hey I'm not going to complain. It could have been worse. It could have been worse, but it, with no migration, the migration rig does not work. <laughs> what time is it? Lunch time. <laughs> Joey want wingy. <laughs> Joey want wingy. <laughs> you know where we're at. The old B-dubs. Yeah, the old B-dubs. It's the happening spot usually. On the way back to the lodge, nice and easy. Old Frederick, you got to stay in the truck. Woo! Well, I'm done editing that video. My goodness. Yeah, been through three drinks. Yeah, who knows what else? Just got her done. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, the migration rig video. I want to let y'all know I have two really, really, really good videos coming at y'all. One, Gerald comes back in town, all the guides, and we have a snow goose hunt out of A-frames. And then number two, the second one. It might even go up before that video, I don't know. But it's a three-man hunt that I did yesterday. Three-man, and we shot the you-know-what out of them. 
we piled them up over sheet water, full bodies, and an A-frame in the center of a cut bean field. You do not want to miss this hunt. Probably one of my top two of the of the season. Probably one of my favorite ever in my life, to be quite honest. But subscribe if you haven't. Hit that notification bell down there. It'll notify you when your boy uploads. Uh, there's like, I think it's like 44% of y'all now that have not subscribed. Y'all need to do so. Come on now. If you guys have any recommendations for videos that you guys want me to do, I know you guys want to see some crow hunting. Uh, we're going to be able to do it now. I have a little bit of traveling that I'm going to be doing here. Uh, some family stuff going on. But let me know down in the comment section what you guys want to see. Like I said, thank you all for always supporting me and purchasing Ducks Waterfowl gear. If you guys want to pick up something, I will link it down in the description below. Thank you to Joe Preston Gage for helping me set the, my, the, the MIG rig. Thank you all. Uh, thank you all for being here. But until next time.